Yeah, good morning, viewers, and welcome to the whole garden crackers and firewood. And today is going to be some more snow removal day. It's not a whole lot to do, but there's a little bit going up the side of the driveway there. And then and across the front of the house, and a little tiny bit right there. And there's a little bit of the bank beside my truck. And behind the truck's got some, and then down that side of the driveway there, I gotta do some. And well, it's going to be a bit of time involved, but it's not a whole lot of snow, I guess. But anyway, what I want to kind of show you here this morning was last night when I went in the house, um, because the sun was strong yesterday, it melted all the snow that was on there, which wasn't a whole lot. But by the time the sun kind of was down and I came in the house, all that top of that concrete was just covered nice. And I was thinking all last night and this morning <clears throat> when I go out I'll uh, go to my sand pile and get a bit of sand and cover that up so we don't fall and hurt ourselves. Well, the ice is gone, basically. That's just how fast ice evaporates, just like water. So, that's a good thing. All right, go to the garage and see if I can get there without falling down. I see in spots. Yeah, a little bit of snow, and yeah, there's some over there too. And I gotta go around by the propane tank and And there's a little bit here to do, and a little bit there to do, and a little bit down in here to do. And, uh, and the propane tank has got a, a bank up against it, but really in a way I don't have to do that because I just got filled the other day, so they won't be back for a while. But best to keep it cleaned out so that if need be, I can get fuel or get repairs done to the tank. All right, let's see if we can get in here. It's kind of cool out this morning. weather thing here and uh, we'll have to start figuring out which tractor I'm going to use today. I'm going to have to get a little jar with straws in it and then when you pick out the shortest straw that's the one that wins I guess. <laughs> and oh look at that, that tractor, that cab tractor jumped in the video again. I'm going to have to have a talk with that tractor. You're going to stop doing that. You're going to drive poor Dave at RCA Polar Express into the loony bin if you keep jumping in the video like that. <laughs> All right, I'm going to shut off the music here before I get in trouble. And we'll get the... Uh, Let me get the uh, weather on here. There, there's my fancy camera holding thing. Look at that. All right, so we are at minus 8 degrees this morning, and it is 18 degrees Fahrenheit. Wind is uh, west, 14 kilometers or 9 miles an hour, so it's kind of a nice morning. 
So there's her weather for the up until Tuesday. So that's looking pretty good. A little bit of flurries on Monday, maybe. But that could be a snowstorm. You just never know with the weather people. Anyway, if nothing uh, drastic happens up until the 22nd of February, then we're moving along. Winter's going along. And uh, we'll be into March here soon. So that's a good thing. And I guess we'll have a little look out the door here. A little bit overcast today, but still a little bit of sun coming through. So I'm probably going to just shorten this video up and, and post that maybe. Or I might not. I don't know what I'm going to do. I know this thing cuts off at 30 minutes for some reason. So if I go longer than that, that's... That's kind of annoying when it stops and you think you're still videoing. Uh, well, um, yeah, I want to show something about uh, yeah, the little uh, Saker chainsaw. I kind of want to show you the, the wood chips that come off of it. Well, they're not a bad sized wood chip. The thing chews away pretty good. Well, great little tool. Any of those brands are, are good. They're little saws like that. They, they're certainly handy. One hand operation. So you can uh, hang on to the tree and cut with the other one. With one hand you can hang on and the other one you use the saw to cut with so that's pretty good not like them things you you got to use both hands and anyway that's the way it is uh, the bigger saws take more effort but they're doing bigger wood so all right so we'll have to figure out which one of these we're going to take here today so that's an idea i'll uh, i'll post this video and see which one do you think I should take out today. Now I'm not going to take out that one that jumps in the video all the time. That one up there with the cad. My poor Dave's going to end up in a loony bin if he keeps seeing that. Anyway, either this case today or the John Deere. Which one do I take out to clean up the little bit of snow? Both very capable characters. All right, we'll cut her off at that. There's uh, almost nine minutes of foolishness there. Doesn't take long, does it? All right, have a good day wherever you're at, whatever you're doing. Happy Friday. Goodbye now.